Hi, my name is Yasmin Shamla. I hold an international research grant from the British Academy, the UK's Voice for Social Sciences and the Humanities. The grant I hold supports the creation of a digital archive called Making Home Away, which showcases the ways in which Syrian refugees make homes away. Um, I've been working on this with Dr. Susan Elkin and Dr. Vicki Squire, and also the research assistant on the project has been Dr. Helen Underhill. Dr. Squire, Dr. Elkin, and I have been interviewing Syrian refugees that live in displacement. So for me, that's meant that I've been interviewing Syrian refugees in the refugee camps of Jordan. Um, this work has been, of course, trying and interesting and also surprising at times. Um, because my own background is in literary studies, I've been carrying poems with me in my heart, as E.E. E. Cummings puts it, as I've been having these conversations, mostly in Arabic, with refugees. Um, the thing that I've found that I've needed to sort of make sense of is the ways in which these refugees display this remarkable tendency towards resilience and resourcefulness, um, despite the... Um, limited resources at their disposal. So uh, one poem that I've thought of quite frequently is by Adam Zadayeski. It is called Try to Praise the Mutilated World. It was published in 2001 in September in New York, which means that it was published into carrying a sort of resonance with another global catastrophe. Um, this poem is translated by Claire Cavanaugh. It's a short poem. Um, but it is loaded. So this is Try to Praise the Mutilated World. Try to Praise the Mutilated World. Remember June's long days and wild strawberries, drops of rosé wine, the nettles that methodically overgrow the abandoned homesteads of exiles. You must praise the mutilated world. You watch the stylish yachts and ships. One of them had a long trip ahead of it, while salty oblivion awaited others. You've seen the refugees going nowhere. You've heard the executioners sing joyfully. You should praise the mutilated world. Remember the moments when we were together in a white room and the curtain fluttered. Return in thought to the concert where the music flared. You gathered acorns in the park in autumn and leaves eddied over the earth's scars. Praise the mutilated world, and the gray feather a thrush lost, and the gentle light that strays and vanishes and returns. Thanks for listening.